volcano creates the most intense thunderstorms ever recorded. The January 2022 eruption produced more than 192,000 lightning flashes and sent plumes of volcanic ash 36 miles into the sky. The Hunga Tonga Hunga Haapai volcanic eruption, which produced the most powerful atmospheric explosion ever recorded, also produced a record number of lightning strikes in a thunderstorm. Supercharged that lasts 11 hours and spreads for 150 miles, 240, a new study reports. This volcano located in the southern Pacific Ocean began erupting in December 2021, but its most explosive event did not occur until January 15, 2022. Even though the volcano's caldera is 500 feet 150 meters below sea level, the explosion blasted through the water and sent a plume of ash rising 36 miles 58 kilometers high with an eruptive rate of 11 billion pounds 5 billion kilograms per second, an order of magnitude greater than the eruption of Mount St. Helens in May 1980. There are theoretical limits to how high a plume can go and how fast its eruption rate can be, and the Hunga Tonga eruption just blew it all away, the study's lead author, Alexa Van Eaton of the U.S. Geological Survey, told Space. Another record the eruption broke was the number of lightning strikes. The explosion produced the most intense thunderstorm ever seen, with 2,600 flashes per minute at its peak and a total of around 192,000 flashes for 11 hours. What's more, these thunderstorms occurred at an unprecedented height of between 12 and 19 miles, 20 to 30 kilometers, higher than any lightning seen before. The lightning strike was detected by a network of radio antennas designed to track storms and by two Earth-orbiting space probes. The GOES-17 satellite operated by the U.S. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration NOAA, and the Japan Meteorological Agency's Himawari-8 satellite. We have never seen lightning speed like this before, and at such high altitudes, said Van Eaton. Satellite imagery shows that the lightning does not spread randomly across the plume, but instead occurs in several concentric rings that appear to be associated with each explosive eruption from the volcano. As the plume rises upward, it billows out to form an umbrella cloud, with spilled material falling onto it and oscillating around the neutral buoyancy layer. This imparts vertical motion to the cloud so large that the waves, moving outward from the center of the blob, are 10 vertical kilometers, 6 miles, from crest to trough, said Van Eden. These oscillating pressure waves, also known as gravitational waves, not to be confused with gravitational waves from merging black holes or neutron stars, are the source of lightning. 